everyone and welcome back to my channel my name is molly and please ignore the cute little sign that came with like the little thing i got when i got my tanning for when i sleep it's like a satin sheet almost that like goes in your comforter so that way you don't like get tan all over you especially if you have a white comforter so you don't get tan all over the comforter but it says do not disturb the princess is working on her tan it's cute and my hair is like slipped back into a bun so it kind of looks like i have no hair but you know it's fine i want to film this video today because i have been putting it off for weeks now i want to film what is in my backpack and this is my backpack for school it is a kate spade tote bag i got it on sale so i do not think they sell it anymore if they do i'll link it but I I will link something similar. They might not have the same color. This bag is gorgeous. It's my favorite thing. It is so lightweight. So like I can put a bunch of stuff in here and it's not too bad. I mean, obviously the stuff inside it is heavy, but like it's not that bad. And usually my water bottle is in here, which is like the first thing. So it's heavy or I'll just carry it in my hands depending on what I'm, I have in my bag that day. So yeah, um, first of all, the water bottle is in there normally. That one or a smaller one. That one's from Amazon. That water bottle, my favorite thing ever. So I'm just gonna go through and show you guys what I usually keep in here, what I vary like what things sometimes are in here, sometimes aren't, like things like that, because kind of every day is different depending on my classes. Also, let's just start it because you don't really need that much of an explanation prior. And I will start with this little emergency kit. So I actually put this, I was making this during, ignore my nails, they look so bad because I took my nails off. I made this emergency kit kind of thing during when I was had my video about like resetting for the quarter. And I shortly realized, soon realized this thing's heavy to carry around. So I kind of took some stuff out of it and I put my contacts, I should keep my leave also. I took my contacts out of here and put those in my bag, but otherwise I don't really keep a lot of this on me. If I'm going somewhere for a while, then I'll put this in. But like, if I'm just going to one class for a couple hours, I don't take that little bag. And I'll show you guys where I keep that stuff after. I'm gonna go through like the main things first and then like the smaller things that I have thrown in here. Well, first of all, sunglasses. These are the ones that I've been wearing lately. I like them because they're like really big. So I've been wearing these like daily class and they're black. So they're just very neutral and they go with like anything I'm wearing. Sunglasses are always in my bag. I don't leave my house without sunglasses. And then next is my pencil case, which I'll go through in a second. Let me take out my bigger items so that way this thing's not so heavy on my lap. And the main things I take to class, like the only things I take to class, my laptop, my iPad, and my planner. So I have the MacBook Pro 2020. 20, I think I got it. And then my iPad, it's the, this one's also 2020. The 12.9 inch, it's the huge one. The iPad Pro from 2020. Love this thing. And I use it literally every day, constantly. And then my planner is the little self-care planner. And I bought this actually at a store downtown. It's called the Paris Laundry. And I'm pretty sure you can find this on Amazon, but I did buy it from a small business here, which I really enjoy. So I will be getting a new one of these once I need a new one because it only lasts for six months. But I love it because I won't show you the pages they have now, but I love, I don't know if you can really see it too well i'm obsessed with like the setup of it because it's like ends your entire day and it's undated so you can just kind of jump back and forth if you want to i don't but like if you wanted to you can do the day the to-dos and you can do like self-care things exercise grateful top goal the weather you can write down like i love it and track your meals and water it's my favorite planner ever wicked cute and i take that with me most days it depends on what we're doing in class if we're just kind of like watching presentations things like that then i'll bring it so that way i can like work on other stuff but if we're like doing something else and I know I won't be using a planner, I won't bring it. Sometimes I'll bring it to my beauty class on Tuesday, Thursdays, and then I won't take it to my design class right after because like it's just a lot to carry sometimes. It does add weight to the bag. And since I'm walking places, I don't want to like have that much weight. All right, now that that's off, let's do my pencil case. So I've had this pencil case for like a good three, four years. I definitely had it senior year. I don't know how long before that. It's like that Poppin brand. I don't know, it's like the perfect size for like just a couple things. So first of all, I have some sticky notes, just normal ones, and then I have these little to-do ones they're wicked cute i got these from the i think it was the container store actually and there's like a, another side to it with like a bulleted list or like a dotted bullet page and i just like cut it off so i just had this side so i could keep these like in here and then we got some white out because i will not like cross stuff out i have to use white out and then i have just a couple pens and pencils first of all my apple pencil for my ipad that stays in there or i take it out if i don't take my planner because i if i don't take my planner i don't take my pencil case and i'll just throw my apple pencil in my bag and then i have a pencil I have two pens like black three three black pens because I hate like any color but black for like writing things besides like I'm doing like something fun like I don't like you know like general writing like like tests and stuff like I would only be black ink I don't like blue ink things like that so I have a sharp 
Sharpie gel, the Pilot Precise, and then a Pilot, I don't know, it's like a ballpoint pen. So it's all different types of pens because I just love stationery. Pencil, my colored pen for my planner. I always have one to use in my planner. Changes every week and then a highlighter. Those are all the things in my pencil case. Pretty self-explanatory, pretty basic things. And I have done amazing at narrowing down what supplies I use. This has never been me in the past. So if you know me, like be proud of me that I don't take a million things. <laughs> that I don't take a million things anymore. Um, I always keep a charger. This is like my smaller charger because my iPad and my pencil, I mean my iPad and my, my laptop both have the same. So I'm not gonna take like my big long extension cord charger to class. I'm just gonna take the small one and usually it works anywhere if I need it. Most of the time I don't need to charge my stuff but i'm going to next semester if i have class from 11 to 7 30 every day well two days a week probably gonna need to charge my stuff so i keep that in like one of the small pouches on this side right here right literally right there let's just get the middle of this stuff random things um my wallet always need that on me and my keys as well i have a little safety thing on here yeah basically that stuff airpods i have two sets of airpods because i got a free pair when i got that um, laptop so i keep one in here and then i have an umbrella because it rains constantly usually if it doesn't if it's not going to rain, I won't keep this in here. I just haven't taken it out recently, so I probably should because it's not supposed to rain for another couple days, I don't think. Moving on to some of the side pouches. So like I said, the charger is right there. And then this one, I have a couple snacks. I always have different snacks in my bag. It depends on the day, depends on what I want. Um, I try to keep some fruit snacks in there always so I have something because I didn't bring any snacks today. But I have my Laneige Lip Glowy Balm. It's like basically the lip sleeping mask, but like in this form. I honestly don't know what's different about it than the lip sleeping mask, mask besides the fact that it's in a tube. I love this thing. My chapsticks will change out pretty frequently. It kind of depends on what I feel. I haven't taken this out in a while, so that's in there. And then lastly, there's a zip pocket in the back here. So I do have a couple girl things. And then I have contacts i always have these on me because you never know when my contacts are going to act up and i'll have to take it out and sometimes if i don't have anything on me i'll just have to take it out and then like put it back in my eye and just hope it's fine again but having a backup set amazing the best thing i've ever started doing i have a little hand sanitizer i don't ever use this i'll either just wash my hands or i just don't really care that much so honestly i don't know why i still have this because i don't ever use it it's definitely oh it's expired it expired in july so that's trash and this is the leave so i always keep a leave on me it's one of the tri like travel size tubes and then i just refill it up with like the main with like the big jar but yeah basically that's all i keep in my bag it's very simple because all i need for class is like a laptop and ipad because i do all my artwork on my things and if not i'll just take a separate bag to class that day but like for the most part my major i don't need anything else if my design class requires me to bring something else i will but i've been doing a lot of stuff digitally so it's worked out that i haven't had to bring anything else the one time i did was last two weeks ago i had to bring stuff to draw on newspaper but yeah, basically that's all I have in my bag. My wire bottle usually fits right in there perfectly too. So I don't have to hold it in my hands. And I have a smaller one also. So I usually don't have to carry like a heavy one. And I'll just keep filling it up with water. And I'll just fill the whole thing with ice before I leave. But for the most part, I don't know, it's pretty self-explanatory. Pretty simple. So I guess I won't drag this out any longer than it has to be. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thank you all so, so, so much for watching. And I'll see you guys on my next video. Oh, and by the way, I'm going to try to link as much as I can down below for you. If I remember. I definitely will. It's as much as I can is linked down below. Thank you guys so much for watching. See you guys in my next video. Bye guys.